John Barbados Artist Side came out in March 2009. It's a citrus herbal. It's pretty good. I gotta admit. It's not that bad. Craftsmanship? Look at this. Little fucking kids. Fucking third world countries made this for five cents. Look at the fucking work that's been put into this. Even the cap is hot. Usually caps are half assed. It's fucking hot. What am I doing? I look like a fucking jerk. God. <laughs> Hi. Anyways, I'm going to sit here with my hands restricted the whole time. John Borvedo's Artisan. It's, uh, it's def definitely a citrus, cologne citrus. Because it's fucking, like, fucking blast the orange one, fucker. Come on. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> fucker. <clears throat> yeah. Alright, so bottle design. It doesn't even matter what is inside. I'm surprised my hair looks this good after all that. It doesn't even matter what's inside juice wise. The bottle presentation gets an A. Plus. I mean, this is fucking somebody's hard work has been put into this. The cap's banging. Oh my god. Clementine. Sicilian Clementine. Me being Sicilian myself. It fucking goes hand in hand. Great spring and summer fragrance. Very fresh. Very refreshing. Huh, fucker? You ever think of that? Fucking up your vocabulary with all these fancy words. Bitch! It's got Greek lavender, Mexican tangerine, tangelo fruit, Sicilian clementine, Spanish. Fuck all these words. You don't care. You just want to know what I think. I honestly give this... I want to give it a 10 out of 10, but... It's longevity is horrible. Uh, projection is good for the first couple hours. It's an amazing comforting comfort fragrance. Say you're at home by yourself, lo lounging around the house. This is a great fragrance. Does get you co compliments, but you gotta be in close quarters. Like you gotta have a broad next to you, maybe a snuggle, fuggle, fuckle time, because you know it's it's probably my favorite out of the John Barbados line, aside from his original. And the longevity just isn't very great, but you know, I love this smell. You don't get any fresher than this. It's a different orange from Clinique Happy and even uh, Bond Number Nine's Little Italy. Little Italy is more of a fresh orange, like the mist, like pussy mist. And this is more like I shouldn't have said pussy. My mom's gonna look at me. I'm just fucking with you guys. She loves it. She loves pussy. Well, she don't love it. She has one. <laughs> Anyways, but yeah, look at this fantastic bottle. Um. You shop around, you can get a good price on this. Otherwise, Sephora is probably going to hit you with the famous $70 mark. 4.2 ounce. Which ain't bad. This is a great everyday scent. Uh, this is this could be your signature cologne. Except in the winter, it's going to suck dick. So maybe get Yop or something. But, um... Yeah, man. When I smell this, I just imagine a great summer day. You and your girlfriend just got done, you know, <laughs> 69 and like usual. <laughs> That was her booche. Anyways, that was her putty getting popped. But yeah, this is a fantastic bottle. I love it. It looks great on the shelf. It's fucking empty, though. There is there is nothing in here at all. I'm actually holding the glass bottle. I had maybe 10 mLs of it and it was gone. But yeah, it's a pretty great fragrance. I uh, It's good stuff. Um, How many sprays? You could put 10 of this on. You're really not going to offend anybody. If anything, it'll help your projection and longevity. I advise spraying it on your dick, so it don't smell like bowls, smell like bowl, orange bowls, kind of, makes sense. Anyways, I look so cute today. No, I don't. My hair is pretty stable for wearing a fucking hot mask. But yeah, so, John Varvatos Artisan, I really would say like 10 out of 10 is a great scent, but I'm actually going to give it a 5 out of 10. That's fucking horrible. Not because it's a great scent, it's just, it's gone no one's gonna smell it in a, like an hour or maybe two and if your skin really sucks if it dry skin a half hour that fragrance is gone and you don't want to drench yourself in it then you just look like an asshole <laughs> this guy <laughs> but yeah um i'd say four sprays on the neck two uh, twice on each wrist one behind the neck one on your balls exactly that's what you gotta do um 
I know my mom really, this is her favorite. She's not here right now. Sorry, guys, don't fucking cry. But, uh, she really likes his scent. But, like I said, um, empty glass. And, I don't know. It's, uh, it's just a great looking bottle, you know? Some fucker worked her ass off. I'm Joey Cano. Fuck you. I'm Joey Cannoli, and, uh, bye. I don't want to end the video like that. Uh, see you guys later. Wait, I don't like the way my face looks. No, fuck. Fuck. Anyways, guys. Be sure to like the video, because it helps me feel better about myself. You know, just me crying for help. I'm not going to give away a bottle, but I it'll make me happy. So if you're all about making people happy, you gotta fucking like the fucking video. So I'll see you later.